because I um, had a severe um, TMJ uh, pain in my jaw and then I came to Dr. Afzali and she said that the only um, way that we can fix that problem is with starting the fast braces and uh, I didn't believe it at the beginning but she started on the four top teeth and within a couple of days it was gone the pain was gone and I haven't experienced it till now they said that they have to do surgery or inject some Botox in the muscles and you know uh, I was against it because I don't want to leave a scar on my face and also the uh, surgery is like serious so um, and I didn't even know that the fast braces or any kind of braces can you know help that and um, Fortunately, I met Dr. Afzali and after she started, as I mentioned, uh, the pain is gone completely. So I have like a better sleep and uh, my migraine headache is gone because I don't, you know, use the bite that I used to have. And I think that's all because of the fast braces. I had um, really bad TMJ pain. Um, my jaws always locked. Um, I grinded my teeth, I clench. I couldn't chew properly. Chewing was with, or biting into certain things, just could not do that. And I had gone to other orthodontists and they told me that they were gonna have to do jaw surgery, um, TMJ surgery, um, and pull out a bunch of teeth. And then when I came over, when I saw Dr. Sally, she said that I wasn't gonna need any surgery and she was gonna do braces without any. And um, I know I had a 20, some 20 plus overbite, and now it's like a three, so it's awesome, big difference. I don't snore anymore, I, I snored. <laughs> I don't snore anymore, I don't do any of that stuff anymore. It, the pain in my, t in my jaws where the TMJ problems, I had are completely gone. It, it feels really different, it feels nice. Uh, no pain, I, I used to have pain when I smile. And now I don't. So. I know I already had the MJ problem, and then I started to have the clicking sound on my jaw, which re jaws, which really scared me a lot. And so that's what I uh, told Dr. Abzali about my problem. And I really saw the changes that's happening. You know, the uh, clicking sound is getting lesser, and then I could see you know, that there are improvements going on. So I was really inspired by that. When I was searching for TMJ treatment options, I wasn't interested in Botox injections and I really didn't want to have to commit to a nightly mouth guard. Neither of those options seemed like good non-invasive solutions to me. I did not realize how much fast braces can actually adjust your bite, your jaw, your palate, things like that. I wasn't aware that was something braces could do. So uh, once I saw that, I, I felt so much more confident in doing this type of treatment. Um, I believed that it would work and I'm so happy to report that it did. And within one month, my TMJ pain had gone away completely. I started in December and by January, I no longer had that ball of swelling up in my jaw and I could sleep a lot better, eating was easier, um, and everything felt better. I got a couple consultations. Uh, they are saying that I needed some jaw surgery to fix uh, underbite. So I was considering that until I came here. Uh, she kind of knocked some sense into me saying that jaw surgery is really a big, uh, something really big to consider. It takes like, they have to relearn how to eat, relearn how to talk, so she, uh, basically recommended me to come here and uh, that she could fix my underbite without jaw surgery. In my entire life, I've, I had a, a pretty severe overbite and I had a fairly decent gap in the front of my teeth. And um, those were things that I was always a little self-conscious of, but was always told that because I had some issues with being a tongue thruster that I wouldn't be able to wear braces and have that repaired. Dr. Afzali dispelled all the myths around all the things that I'd been told and um, we went with some fast braces and everything's been perfectly repaired. A huge improvements. Um, I now have a bite, <laughs> whereas before things were misaligned to the point that I didn't even necessarily know what a normal bite felt like and now I do. So that's been taken care of. Um, I no longer have an overbite. I no longer have a, a gap in the front of my teeth. And I am also feeling very confident that the bone is 
coming down and not receding and that I'll be able to keep my teeth for the rest of my life. I definitely sleep better um, because I've always used a CPAP to sleep with and now everything, um, the breathing seems to be a whole lot easier for me. So sleeping's become much easier. I used to get headaches and now they diminish and I'm able to eat a little bit better, I feel. It helps with mastication. So it's being also functional. It doesn't just look okay and better, but it's also functional. I initially came because I was having pain um, on one of my teeth in the back. The way my bite was that it was down on one side and an underbite, but I would continue to have the same um, kind of problem and possibly lose more teeth. So it was gonna be where I would have to break my jaw and then wear braces for uh, like three to four years. Um, but now I didn't have to have surgery and it's been, I think a little under a year and a half. My bite, I can tell on even both sides, the side with less teeth, it is a stronger contact, uh, point of contact. And I can chew easier. I can chew things I didn't, wasn't able to before. Um, I had actually one of my teeth on my right side was giving me problems and that's why I decided to like come in and then they told me about everything that was going on and um, that I needed braces to fix the problem. So I had an open bite and that's what was causing me issues. So Dr. Afzali advised me on what they needed to do and we didn't have to do instructions. Closing my mouth is a lot easier. Um, my tongue doesn't stick out. Um, it feels weird just because I'm not used to it, so it take a while to get used to it. But um, I'm just glad that they didn't have to extract multiple teeth. Then I had like bunny teeth, you know, just like the front teeth uh, being out a lot. So that was kind of weird, but I mean, the shape of them, they really changed a lot. It was like 13 millimeters of difference. It's a lot. Most people. I think you guys actually have a graph of this. It's like at seven, that's maximum, come fix it. I was at 13 millimeters. Yeah, the fact that they managed to fix it, I think like even in their eyes, it was a miracle, not even mine. I originally went to another site and they said they would need to extract approximately four to six teeth because I have such a, a small jawline. Um, Dr. Afzali was like, no extraction will be needed. I can do the whole treatment without extracting any teeth. Mind you, the only extraction I had was that one molar due to uh, needing a root canal, not because she couldn't do the treatment without extractions. Um, so then I started the treatment and I haven't had any extractions. So definitely the problem was that I had a massive underbite and my jaw was shifted to the side. The smile just feels more confident in general since I have like a big bite. <laughs> it feels more bigger. They, uh, brighter and bigger. <laughs> I wouldn't have thought I would have gone it this way, especially since, uh, like you said before, it was a surgical case and um, you've done it for me and uh, I just want to say thank you.